All right, so Packaholics are back. We have some exciting stuff. Um, your boy finally went out and found a card shop, and so we took some polls that you guys have seen in previous videos, and um, you know, I traded those cards in. They were of value to that card store owner. Uh, he gave me credit for this prism box that we have here today, and so that's what we're gonna open up on the channel. Hopefully, we pull some heat, and then you know, hopefully turn this box into some more boxes for the channel. So my boy David's here and he's gonna open it up. Oh, reliable Excalibur. I think um, this is our first prison box. It is. Yeah, so. so we've been saying we're gonna get some more, we're trying to get some more prism and select and optic. And so we finally got some uh, some prism here. And um, hopefully it treats us well. Yes. Hopefully we didn't just get uh, fleeced for $56. Um, so that's how much it was at the local card store um fifty six dollars um and so it is expensive you know for resell. a blaster box but yeah it is resale the card store owner has to make money off of it you know it is a business i do understand that so um this is what it comes with um i just i really hope we get lucky man i i'm in love with prison box prison uh cards yeah those are probably one of my favorite definitely so all right so we it is three and three i think three and three okay yep. it's just three and three all right, let's get right into it. I'll let you go first. Okay, I'm gonna start off. Let's see. Let's focus in so that you guys get a look for it, and let's do it. All right. What are we What are we aiming for here? Uh, for... so on the box we it says find two Blaster exclusive rookie disco prisms. Uh, look for Blaster exclusive mem cards and unwrap one silver prism per box on average. So again, all these are averages. You know they have to they have to add this in so that way you know you don't try to sue them. <laughs> and right off the bat, you got a Seahawk of mine right there. Will I like that. Will Disley. Disley, Sam Darnold. He's not even a starter no more. <laughs> he is actually starting this week. He is. Yep. What? Week twelve. So we're on week twelve currently. He is starting for the Panthers this week. Well, let's see how he does. Jamie Newman and Ooh, Dallas Disco. Goddard. He's, uh, if anybody does fantasy, I know you're hurting. You're <laughs> hurting, just like I am in our home league. I have Dallas Goddard, and it's tough out here, man. Hey, he was good for you for a few weeks, though. He was. Pick he him was... off off a waiver, too. Right, that was crazy. And somebody dropped him. I'll take it. All right, so ripping it into the next one. Let's see what we can get. All right, we got T.Y. Hilton. Did he retire? Uh, yes, I believe he did. <laughs> Kenyon Drake. Kenyon Drake. Ooh, we silver. got a silver... Oh, a Seahawk. Seahawk legend, by the way. Steve Largent. And we have an emergent, Najee Harris. Finally did something this past week. And then he went off. And in the home league, I have him finally. So, you know, <laughs> he didn't secure me the dub, sadly. I still lost, but it's nice to see him finally do something. Yeah, I'm glad. I mean, he's such a good running back. Yeah, he's been struggling, but yeah. hopefully... And, you know, Warren got injured, so that kind of helped him out as well. Yeah. All right, for the PC, Devin McCourty. Ooh, we have Eckler. A Austin Eckler. Got him in my in the home league as well. Facts. Denzel Ward and a disco rookie. Disco rookie. Dez. Dez Fitzpatrick. Fitzpatrick. That's really nice. I like this one. Yeah, that's dope. Nice. All right, so going right into the next one. Thank God these are a little bit easier to open. Mm -hmm. All right. Starting off with a Chase Edmonds. Oof. <laughs> he just got injured as well. Um, we got Oof. Michael Thomas. Man, all these, all these injured, injuries, man. Yeah, all these injured players. Uh, Hunter Long. I don't even know who that is, but it's a rookie. And, ooh, another rookie Tennessee Titans Racing McMath Disco. So I'll put that over there with the discos. Disco, disco. All right, let's see. Yeah, this uh, might be labeled as the injury box. <laughs> the, injury. It's the uh, it's the IR box. The IR box. My leg. Honestly, <laughs> oh, my leg. Help! Help! My leg. All right, we got Marshall. Marshall, Marshall Falk. Falk. Yep, Marshall Falk, legendary running back. Boy Hayden Hurst. Okay. Kyle Pitts, another, another injury. injury. <laughs> Sample. Drew Sample on the disco for the uh, for the Bengals. <laughs> Yo, this this is tough. <laughs> super tough. All right, let's oh, see. Man. Last pack. Let's see if we can get some last pack magic here. Pray for it. Let's see. 
That's We've got a Laramie Tunsil, Cole Beasley, retired, and Jerome Bettis. Last card's gonna be a Disco Pat Tillman Legend. So, uh, not bad, not horribly bad. But like you said, this is definite. This was definitely the IR box. Definitely. Um, hopefully, in the future. Um, when we pull some more of these, they'll be better. Um, yeah. And so it's not to discourage you guys. Yeah, no, game. definitely not. You, as you guys know, some boxes come with heat, some don't. It's it's the way of the game. And sometimes it may be good, sometimes it may be shit. Who knows? Maybe be maybe better luck next time. Uh, you just gotta keep on rolling with it. Don't get discouraged. You just gotta keep on doing it for the fun. Facts, facts. Mm -hmm. Well said, well said. So uh, this has been the Packaholics. We're gonna bring you another one soon. Don't worry. And uh, it's your boy Bean, David, and we'll see you guys next time. Peace.